Hello, welcome to Tejas Education. How are you all doing children? Let's learn about aluminium smelting industry which comes under manufacturing industry class 10 CBSC board. Aluminium smelting is the second most important metallurgical industry in India. What is smelting? The process of extracting aluminium from its oxide. What is a metallurgical industry? The industry that deals with the production of metal from its ore and also production of alloy from ingots. Alloys are metals which are mixed with other elements so that it gains strength and also has high resistance for corrosion. And also this industry deals in recovering metal from scrap and salvage. How we are trying to recover aluminium from scrap? If you see the beverage cans, Coke, Pepsi, they all come in aluminium can. So aluminium recycling is done how by using these beverage cans because these beverage cans contain the largest component of processed aluminium okay while the recycling happens they are again manufactured back into cans salvage means we are trying to rescue here what we are doing in an old ship or an old building if there is some aluminium door window it has again recovered and reused okay now let's learn the property of aluminium. Aluminium, it is light resistant to corrosion. It is a good conductor of heat. We have learned this in electricity chapter of physics, CBSC, class 10. And one more property is it is malleable. It can be turned into sheets and become strong when it's mixed with other metal. Also, we see the ductile nature. If we can stretch it into the form of wire, right? Uses of aluminium. It is used to manufacture, manufacture aircraft, utensils, wires. It has gained popularity as a substitute of steel, lead, zinc and copper. Hope this is clear children. Aluminium smelting plants are located. This is an important question. Map question. They will ask you to locate aluminium smelting plants. In different states of India, Odisha, West Bengal, Kerala, Uttar Pradesh, Chhattisgarh, Maharashtra, and Tamil Nadu. Please practice. In 2014 and 2015, India produced about 3.96 million tons of aluminium. This is just for knowledge. If they ask for MCQ, well and good. We already know the answer, right? Now comes the raw material for this industry that is bauxite. Again, very important MCQ question. Bauxite, the raw material used in smelters, is a very bulky, dark, reddish colored rock. Okay. The flow chart given below shows the process of manufacturing aluminium. 4 to 6 tons of bauxite is getting converted to 2 tons of alumina and at the end 1 tons of aluminium. If you need to understand this in detail, please go to page 74 of geography textbook. It will be easily able to grasp the whole process. Factors responsible for location of aluminium smelting industry, regular supply of electricity, availability of raw material as transportation cost will be less. So pl please write a small introduction, these three points, one, two, three and a conclusion according to the mark. Two mark, three mark or five mark. We know how to elaborate, right? Re just one I will say, regular supply of electricity. The regular supply of electricity is a must for the production of aluminium. If the supply is irregular, it will affect the production of aluminium. Like that, you have to elaborate. Let's do the activity question. A factory produces aluminium saucepans with plastic handles. It obtains aluminium from a smelter and a plastic component from another factory. All the manufactured saucepans are sent to a warehouse. First question, which raw material is likely to be most expensive to transport and why? Answer is bauxite as it is very bulky. Which raw material is likely to be cheapest to transport and why? It will be plastic as it is lighter. Do you think the cost of transporting the finished products after packaging is likely to be cheaper or more expensive than the cost of transporting aluminium and plastic? Why? The answer should be 
the cost of transporting the finished products is way cheaper than transporting the raw materials because we can easily organize the finished products inside a truck as they come in cartons. They won't take much space. Thanks for watching. Do like, share and subscribe Tejas Education. All the best for the upcoming board exam. Thanks again.